So here we go, we've got the new inverter up. We have the monitoring antenna. I put in the monitoring thing up top there. I've connected my grounds again. I've connected all my wires again. If you'll notice, I don't have any wires sticking out. Let me see if I can get this focus going on here. Maybe too close, there we go. So, um, you'll notice I don't have any wires sticking out. Sometimes I'll come and I'll see little pieces of metal wires, strands sticking out, that's a no-no. So I've got all of this and look, it matches. Red, red, black, black, white, white, super easy. And now it's time to turn it on. So the first thing I do is I turn on my AC disconnect. And then I should get some lights showing up here, I do. Then I'll put this on and turn it on. We'll also turn this switch to the middle. Now that's on and getting ready for us to go. Next, well, let me get my code off of the camera. We'll open up our setup. So, here we go. This is how we commission a system for the first time. We just turned it on. I open up my setup. It says, let's see, it doesn't, it's not focusing. says scan QR code. So we come over here, bam, it beeps. Now it tells us to move this over to the side for a second. That initiates the Wi-Fi in here and has it start looking from my phone. Oh, we connected, okay. Now we connect, now it's gonna process. It's gonna upload the firmware, it says 30 seconds. Once it's done uploading the firmware, let's see here. So there we go, we're updating, uploading the firmware. After that, it'll say updating the inverter and that'll take like six minutes or more, rarely less. All right, so I just got my activation completed. I hit start commissioning. I have my knob on, I have the AC disconnect on and I have the toggle switch on. Now I come to Pairing, start pairing, that's a little warning, that's fairly new. Now it says DC voltage is decreasing, so it's beginning its pairing process. This takes three minutes, and it'll start doing a countdown here in a second, but for now I'm gonna get out. See, there we go, voltage is decreasing. And I'm gonna go down to my status. I like watching status during this. So, man, it stinks that I can't get this to focus right. So here we go, it says zero of zero communicating. But now we're counting down 165 seconds left. So after it does this countdown, 
Then it'll do a five minute countdown where it matches the frequency with the street. We'll start seeing these optimizers counting up and we should hear it click on. So I'll come back when that gets closer to that happening. Here we are, we are downloading or it's doing its grid monitoring. There's 170 seconds left. It's finished its pairing. And as you can see, we've gotten 13 of the 30 optimizers communicating and we're also got our cellular says SOK. So that means it's connected to the internet. We'll be able to monitor it remotely. And this optimizer's communicating should keep going up to uh, 30 because that's how many panels there are. And so it has 150 seconds. We're up to 14 now. And sometimes it takes hours for these panels to all the way come up, but not usually. So I'll be back here in about 140 seconds and we'll listen to this inverter click on so you know that it's working and producing and we'll look at the, mon the screen here again and show you that as well. All right. There we go, we heard it click on right there. Now we come back here and look at our screen we see 29 of 29 panels showing. We're waiting for one more. Now you can see we're producing 6.2 kilowatts. And this system is working. Let's see if we can get that last panel to show up here. There it is, 30 of 30. We're good to go.